And if you're wondering, 95 days until Pirates opening day here locally at PNC Park as well. It doesn't seem like it can get here soon enough with these temperatures that we've been dealing with. Another sign that it's been cold. You can see some of the ice going down the Allegheny right there. Just uh, quickly point that out at 17 degrees. Some light snow is being reported at the Pittsburgh Airport, but overall we are looking at uh, really having to wait until the overnight hours before we get anything that's going to be accumulating or really impacts you in any real way. Here's those temperatures. Butler 16, Latrobe 60 degrees, Dubois at 11, Franklin also 14 degrees for the temperature. High temperature today about 22. Chilly, obviously, with cloudy conditions and some snow flurries here and there is going to be expected. Your forecasts for the afternoon 19 by 1, 3 o'clock temperature 21. It will go about 20 degrees at 5 o'clock. Dry and chilly weather also as of 5 o'clock. Now, as we're heading into the overnight hours and tomorrow, we are expecting to see some snow. Now, most of this, even though this is the same Monday, most of this is going to fall before noon on Saturday. So starts at 10 o'clock uh, this afternoon into the evening hours goes through about 11 noon tomorrow and we're going to be looking at about two inches falling in that time period. You'll notice that our snow totals actually have ticked up just a little bit and the other area that we've been really watching is going to be elevated areas to the southwest right along the uh, turnpike where we could see some fairly large totals. So we're looking at four to five, maybe even upwards of six inches of snow that will be available down that way. Also, it does look like places along I-70 you'll have a little bit better of a chance for some snow than what you're generally used to. You generally say, hey, we'll probably get a little bit less in Pittsburgh. Might not be the case over the next 24 hours. You might get a little bit more uh, than most of western Pennsylvania. We do still have some advisories out there. Lake effect snow warning for Erie. Uh, updated numbers there, 103 inches for the season is what Erie has seen for snow. Their average for the season is actually 101. They've already hit their snow totals for the year. You can also see just off to our west, if you are heading over into Ohio, they do have winter weather advisories because of the snow that they are expecting. For us, snow will arrive. It's ready to get to the overnight hours tonight. Notice the time, 4 o'clock in the morning. Temperatures, well, not too bad, considering where we've been over the last couple of days at about 17 degrees. We'll continue to see that snow here. Now, even though as we're heading into the afternoon hours, we won't see a steady snow. Some of the more dangerous conditions could happen in the afternoon hours because of some squall lines and some squall conditions that could be possible. So rapidly changing uh, conditions out there uh, will be possible tomorrow afternoon and breezy conditions could mean some blowing snow. So your weekend forecast, there it is, Saturday 23, Sunday 18 degrees. And I just wanted to say also your New Year's high 15 degrees could be the coldest New Year we've seen in 40 years. Your seven day outlook, it's a chilly one. In fact, it looks like we'd stay cold all the way through next weekend.